Well, what's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Cesar, and we are talking about 16 different altcoins today at the request of you, the viewers. You guys, I'm just going to be frank with you here, okay? I've tried to make this video. This would be my third time doing it, and I've spent a decent amount of time on the other two times doing it, and uh, technical difficulties will not allow me to publish. Actually, it's not that it won't allow me to publish. I just, I did publish the most recent video. There was no sound. I don't know why there was no sound. It said there was sound on my mic here. It didn't say it was on OBS, and I didn't check for once. I just didn't check. I normally do a sound check um, at the beginning, but um, before before I you know start running the video, I never have it on the video, but. I'm looking at it now, sounds there, everything's fine. What I'm trying to say, and I'm saying it very poorly because I'm taking a lot of time doing it, is what, I, what I'm trying to say is I don't want to take a lot of time to go over this video. I've done it three times. I will have done it three times now by the end of it. I will have spent probably a total of over two hours alone just on this video by the time I'm done with this. So uh, hit that like button and subscribe if you like hearing me complain. <laughs> hit it. If you don't like hearing me complain, you want me to stop because we're about to get into the TA now. I'm going to go over the list. The list will be in the description below uh, with timestamps as well. So if you want to scroll down and just check that out, you know, flick through, flip through it. I do appreciate everybody who watches the video from the beginning to the end. It does help. Viewer duration does matter. The longer that you guys watch it, even if you're just playing it in the background, it, it helps, man. Um, it really does help. Um, but anyways, hit that like button and subscribe. That also helps a lot. We're going to go over the list right now verbally, but again, the list is down below. WTK for the Unleavened Baptist, AMP and Aurora for the Unlawful Law. Unlawful Law, not the Unlawful Law. He's just Unlawful Law. SRX for the Determined, Link for Black Mamba, Well and Degen for Kevins, ETC for Brad C, Forta for Mo L, Luna Classic for Mr. Party Boy, Super Trump for Bitcoin Busa, Uniswap for Cake grinder dnt and merlin for dementia joe pda for muhammad arafa and velo for tanya rober or robber or robert um that's that's the list that's what we're doing so uh again i've done this this will be my third time now so guys i know what i want to say and i i've i've put time into it so just trust me on the analysis i'm not going to be as descriptive but essentially uh mr unleavened baptist i think that you are going to move down to about 5.2 to 4.7 cents you're at 5.75 cents now um actually I'm sorry. I take that back. That's not where I think you're going to move down. I think you're going to move down to about three to three point three cents. That's that's what my actual thoughts are. I remember my analysis. I, I was just going off of that there, um, and that would make sense. That would make sense. But generally speaking, you know, you do go to, to the one hundred to the eight eight six. But I'm not calling for that this time because that hasn't been what you've been doing at all in this whole way up. So you've been actually going from top to bottom, top to bottom of this whole channel up. I would assume that you go down to your six one eight. That's a very normal retracement to make from a low to high. So three point seven five to three point three cents, even three cents itself is on the table you're at 5.75 cents now it will probably take weeks you will not be a part of any of this june excitement for some cryptos you had your excitement you're consolidating moves up fast moves down slow moves up fast moves down slow so wait a month wait wait probably even multiple months before you're above this high again right going down over the coming weeks if i'm wrong on that it'll still probably be multiple weeks that you're moving down right if it doesn't take a month or more for you to continue to find your low it's still going to be some time from now so uh, AMP, I'm not move, moving through this fast enough, guys. I'm not going to get to sleep. AMP is looking good. I do think that it is going to move up. I like the weekly RSI on it. Um, yes, I know that your weekly looks bad with this uh, wick, but really you're just consolidating. Your daily RSI looks great. I think you're about to break out of this of this consolidation phase here, and I think that your next move to look for is at about 1.1 to 1.2 cents. Um, yeah. And you'll have that once you break above about 0 0.00857. When you break that on a daily, 1.1 to 1.2 cents is on the table. And beyond that, even you're going to 2.2 to 3.3 cents inevitably. So that's AMP, Aurora, uh, USD. If I could just spell. <clears throat> I think I was calling for this one to go lower. Yes, probably down to about 15 cents. That's what I think for Aurora, SRX. Um, Storks, <clears throat> Store X. It's consolidating. It's boring. It won't be boring whenever it finally breaks out. But when will that be? I don't know. You could move down from here and then you know be fine. You could be. This is your last like attempt at this this resistance zone, and you're about to break it. It could be any day now, any week now. But if it's not, you might go down a little bit. You're at 43.4 cents. Maybe you go down to like 36 cents at the lowest. You're you're not going to go down too too much. Um, <clears throat> And whenever you break out to the upside, you could expect to see a kind of mimicked move to this here, right? If you moved up this much, if we take this to your like the base of your consolidation range, 
perhaps you could expect to see a move that would take you to your all-time highs at about uh, 9.6 cents, 9.7 cents. Um, yeah, that wouldn't be crazy at all. If not there, at least expect something that would take you above 50 cents over the coming weeks, months, very soon. That's my thoughts on SRX. Consolidating until it's not. I don't think that it is going to move down. I actually do think you're going to break out to the upside here very soon, but I could be wrong on that. Um, well, nope, I'm sorry. Link is the next one. Link on Coinbase. Yep, I think it is going to go down. $15.32. $15.33 to $16.55. That's what I think. You interacted with the 61869. Now you're going to have a standard pullback to your 0 0.5 or 382, bouncing somewhere in this range between about $16.5 to $15.33. That's Chainlink. Well, for Kevin's, uh, we're not going to do HTX. Moonwell here. Um, probably moving lower. Yes, I think so. You're probably moving lower. So. Where are you gonna go? Relative low to high here. Yeah, we can see you down at about, I'd say two cents, just below two cents. Sounds about right to me, that's well. Um, let me just double check that real quick. I think so, yeah, I think so. Um, next one is DGEN, right? DGEN USD. Maybe on the daily. Looking good, looking like it wants to continue to climb actually. So from a relative high to low, I think we get, we could expect to see 2.8 to 3.1, 3.12 cents, something like that as your next target area. That could happen sometime in like the first or second week of June, maybe later than that, but that's that's my thoughts on DGEN. Um, you're at 2.3 cents now. We're talking about 2.8 to 3.12 as your target area or beyond. Absolutely, you could go higher. ETC for Brad C. Ethereum Classic, I think it does want to move higher. I do think it wants to move higher. I think it's going to go, its next target area technically is $47 ish, 46 and a half, but I think you're moving all the way up to 64 to $77, somewhere in that area. That's ETC for Brad C. Um, Fort, uh, Fort, it's Fort, that's right. For Mo L, Fort. <clears throat> um, is consolidating as well. I actually think it looks very good. I remember 25.7 cents right now. I think we're going to move up to 62 to 90 cents soon. You're going to consolidate. It could be weeks. It could be even over a month. But when you do finally break out, it's going to be phenomenal. Um, and that could happen any day now. It could happen further away from now, but I think you are coming to the end of this consolidation. Coming to the end of it isn't saying much. I mean, I guess it is saying much, but I mean, you, you've been consolidating now for 103 days, 102 days. So, um, coming to an end soon could be another two weeks from now, right? Or, or even a month from now. Uh, but yes, soon enough, any day, any week, any month now, 62 to 90 cents, that's where you're gonna go. Luna Classic, um, it's actually Luna on Kraken. Luna 2 is the new Luna, but Luna Classic, yes, I think you're gonna move up. I think you're working your way slowly up to three zeros one. And then from there, we can talk about you going up to three zeros two, but let's see how you interact with that three zeros one. I would expect when you break that, you probably come up to this three zeros one eight area and find resistance there, but you're working your way up. It'll probably take several days, if not even a couple of weeks before you break this line. So you're just slowly working your way up there. Daily RSI looks great. Um, Super Trump, Super Trump. Come on now, Super Trump. Also looking great. I remember this is actually, uh, spoiler alert, this is the winner for the uh, the whole request video. I was I was saying that at the end there. Bitcoin Busa, you're the one that, that wins tonight. So I think I think this one is going to see the most growth in the shortest amount of time. It went up, or it's at 1.3 cents now. I think it'll go up to about 7 cents to even 19 cents in a very short amount of time. This is on the daily chart. I think over the coming weeks, sometime in June, 7 to 19 cents. It's a big range, but that's the range we're given. I really like what you're doing right here above the 618. You broke through it, interacting well, nice volume. Beautiful RSI, it all looks good. I think you're going up to your extended area, seeing new all-time highs. That's that's super Trump, definitely the winner. No questions asked out of all the coins that we've looked at so far. Uniswap, and by the end of this video even, it's, it's definitely the winner. Um, Uniswap, at 10 cents now, I remember saying it was gonna go down, yes. Down to about 8.85 cents, sounds about right to me. And then up, if you go a little bit lower, that's okay. You have previous areas of resistance, that is your breakout point. Going back to your breakout point is fine. So even if you go down to like $8.20, you're okay. 
eight dollars twenty, eight dollars ninety, somewhere around there. That's Uniswap. Um, DNT for Dementia Joe. DNT is dirt something. I don't know. Um, looking like it wants to go down. Yes, I do think it does want to go down. I think it does. We're looking for a price around four point eight cents to four cents itself. That's DNT. If I'm wrong on that, you know, maybe it is working its way up, but I think it. I think it looks like it wants to go down. Um, Merlin is Merle. We're gonna look at it on crypto here. Looking at it on crypto, yes, I think it's gonna break out too very soon. I think it is gonna break out soon. Um, I don't know where to draw these fibs from though, honestly. So I would just assume maybe 80 cents to a dollar. You're at 53.35 cents right now, so uh, 80 cents to a dollar sounds about right to me. Moving up though, when you break out, it'll probably be a nice move up. You could continue to like slowly work your way up too at a decent rate, but I think I think soon you're gonna see a nice little pop probably up to that like 80 cent area would be my thoughts. Um, that's Merle. PDA for Mohammed Arafa. Consolidating until it's not, I don't know what to say because this daily RSI rejecting the 60 area twice is not necessarily a good thing. You could come down a little bit and still be fine, right? You could come down all the way down here and still be fine. Um, if you were to see a move like that in your RSI, that could call for somewhat lower prices than you are now. I wouldn't be surprised if you went back to the bottom of this range around like 7.2 to 7.6 cents. You're at 8.25 cents now, so a little bit lower. And then we could talk about you going up. I think you're moving down for the time being though. That's PDA. And then to finish this bad boy up with Velo, I think it's the red one. I think that's what you wanted. Uh, that's the one that everybody wants. Nobody asked for Velo drums. So we're, we're doing Velo here. Velo on the weekly. Looking great on the weekly, actually. Very, very good. On the daily, not as good. Probably comes down a little bit. Maybe down to like 1.5 cents. You're at 1.7 now. A little bit below 1.5 cents wouldn't hurt. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, 1.5. I feel pretty good about that. One, one and a half cent. A little bit below that even if you go down to about 1.18 cents that's okay so down from here and then up congratulations mr busa you're the winner with super trump i'll see you guys on the next one hit that like button subscribe to see more thank you all for coming bye bye